what up what up welcome back to the channel i'm on ij and we are locked in you seen the thumbnail effie's family turned her into a demon now we don't really know too much about effie except that she goes to yale she moves a little bit of work and her family isn't really around so we're going to deep dive into what's really going on behind the scenes with her and what direction is courtney kemp trying to go with effie because we all want to know what the hell is Effie really here for? But before we get into this, shout out to the notification gang. If you're new to the channel and you're gonna be a part of it, hit the subscribe button, turn on your notification bell so you get something every time I upload. Hit that like button, it's the easiest thing you can do. Now Effie, she's one of the most known unknowns on the show. We don't get any background on her. We know that she talked to Diana a little bit about what's going on with her family. So we're just gonna read what Courtney Kemp had to say about this and try to piece together some things because Tariq is in jail and Effie might be the one that's taking over the game, thanks to Diana. We head over to CheatSheet.com. This is where I go to to get all the extra information that I may have missed or, you know, just didn't get a chance to get to. But, of course, they give us the overview. Tariq is being locked up, but the whole time, Effie, she's out here thriving. She's getting the work from, from Braden, and she's putting it out on the streets, and she's going to fight for hers. That's one thing about Effie. She's going to make things happen. We know she told on Tariq, but that's a part of the game. But we want to know what about Effie's family is missing out of the picture so we can understand why she acts the way she does. Now, there's a lot we don't know about Effie, but they do say Effie has a major role in Power Book 2. Though Effie appeared in the final season of Power and had a brief role in season one of Ghost, she has a much bigger presence in season two. Effie is a Yale student, no stranger to drama. Now, we know about that. Like I said, she told on Tariq. She told Tariq, oh, my bad, man. You know, it was just about business. They had the stepped on work, a.k.a. the sugar work that they got from Kane. She went out there fighting for it because at the end of the day, this is her reputation. She got to make some money. And also, we see that she was taking Diana out to do a little bit of scamming. We have the little video here where she's telling them, you need to relax. Effie, I'm relaxed, but you don't even look like yourself. Oh, yeah, that's the point. That's because Effie knows how to change to adapt with whatever situation is going on. And that just links back with everything she does with Tariq. She liked Tariq, but she did what she had to do to get what she needed from Tariq, told on Tariq, and now look, she's back to working with Tariq. Effie, that means her mom must have been, mm -hmm, her mom must be teaching her things or taught her things when she was talking to her. Same way Monet is trying to do Diana. But if we look at Yale student, no stranger to drama her official character description reads her quest for financial freedom via drug dealing leads to her being big competition her former uh classmates Tariq and Brayden but when Effie decides to join forces with Tariq and Brayden again she would be forced to determine where her loyalty lies with herself and only herself or with people who have shown her true colors time and time again so I've been hitting on that her and Tariq their relationship I think she still likes Tariq a little bit, but she's came to the realization that it needs to be business between them two. And that's what she's telling Diana. You may be into Tariq, but you shouldn't be involved with Tariq other than business. Now, here's what we know about Effie's family. During a recent Instagram live, Kemp revealed that she could add, if she could add one more spinoff to the Power Universe, it would be centered on Effie. I've said that, that they could probably do another spinoff with Effie maybe give us a little background detail and then halfway through the season show like where we are now and what she's doing on her own but I don't know if they would actually have enough because we'd have to introduce at least a minimum of five to to eight new characters for that and I don't think they could put together a whole story for Effie but we know that Effie is dealing drugs to put herself through school and that she has an estranged relationship with her family in a recent episode of Ghost. Effie asked, uh, Diana asked Effie about her parents and the Yale student replied that they stay out of the way. Now, Effie goes to Yale, people. I'm talking Yale, one of the most prestigious schools in America. So when she's trying to pay for school through drugs, I'm talking about she got to move some bricks. You're not nickel and diamond it to pay for no Yale tuition. Let's just be honest about that. And she lives on campus. So she's spending it roughly 50 50 to $75,000 a year just to go to school. So that lets you know what kind of money she's making out here in these streets. Effie's mom is a mess, but I'll tell you about that later. Kent revealed in the 2020 Instagram live. And if you guys remember close readers of the series, 
Effie's brother is dead. He was murdered. So keep that in mind. And with that being said, there were a couple of people murdered in the original power. And people are saying maybe that's Effie's brother. You know, Tariq killed a couple of people. There's some other characters that died. Now, I'm not going to say any names because we don't know if we can really link anybody to that. And I don't want to hear, oh, Mo, you just making up your own stuff. We know Effie's brother is dead. Could he be a character from the original powers? Yes, maybe. People are also saying, maybe she's Mecca's daughter. Maybe she's somebody powerful daughter also. I don't know. I'm not going to throw those theories out there because we haven't got enough on her. Maybe when the season returns this weekend, we'll get that. And on Sunday during the live stream, we'll discuss it. But as of right now, Effie's family, they have done some things to make her disconnect from them. Now she's out here and it's about Effie. I don't care about anybody else. It's Effie making money for Effie to put Effie through school. Let me know what you think about Effie. Who do you think her brother is? What did her mama do to her? And who could potentially be her father? Also, I've seen something about Tariq and Effie may end up together. Now, I'm not going to go with that. I don't think that that's going to happen. But let me know what you think about Effie's family overall. I'm Odi J. If you like the content on the channel, hit that like button. Hit that subscribe button. Make sure you tune in this Sunday, January 9th, for our live after show discussion of Power Book 2, Episode 6. Thanks for watching. I'm out. Jimmy on a beat, boy.